Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Go with the Plus and the real life and the fucking shit and uh, okay, you get it. Let's go. Okay, guys, we are down here at the Columbia Tech Center Drive Community Park. And we're going to see what's down here. We heard there's lots of Magnemites and other kinds. So we're going to hope to find those and you're going to see it. Okay, so here we go. You guys know the drill by now. If you don't, that means you're not subscribed. And you fucking should be. So, as I said, we had quite a hunch from a few people in the Ventucky region Facebook group. If you're not in it, you should get on your Facebooks and find it. It is the Ventucky region Pokemon Go Trainers Academy group fucking thing. I can't really, it's a long fucking name, honestly. But anyways, go join that. We had a lot of, uh people saying that down here at Columbia Tech Center areas there was lots of Magnemites and so you're going to see in this uh, feature episode that there's quite a few Magnemites around here. Now we were down here around like I think it was 8 o'clock 8.30 now a lot of people were saying it was actually more around 7 p.m. Now the funny thing is before I actually came to this park I was walking around in my neighborhood and yes, lo and behold, all of a sudden, right after like looking online and looking like seeing the comments of where Magnemite was, I'm walking home and it's like 7.15 p.m. and then all of a sudden there's a Magnemite and he just randomly shows up like this is crazy cool. So yeah, anyways, this place ends up being pretty good for Magnemite. I want to go back around 7 p.m. And, and, and see what really happens. See if it, that's maybe like a certain time. We have known that there are timelines in, in time appearances with certain Pokemons in areas. So we all know this, so something definitely to rediscover out. I want to take this time to talk about we all know that this whole new nearby tracking system. Now us, we only have this simple as you saw here this is before the the update so it doesn't show this but you have the sightings here you see those that is like this new way now down in California in San Francisco these people that are select few down there they actually get this version now what this version does is actually shows you where the actual Pokemon's is now how accurate it is i don't know yet i don't know if it's like hey boom right there and literally you walk right there and he's right there i don't know if it's like vicinity or radius still or what we don't know we don't have it up here so we're going to have to wait till this you know and they even said themselves this is a new implemented thing they're trying out they're doing it testings for it so we don't even know if they're really going to keep it what we do know is that they have said on their website, on their um, the different uh, things, that they are fixing the problems. As you can see here, they have fixed the throw and curveball accuracies. So those are now showing up correctly. They, you know, they technically did fix the, the nearby. It, it is better because you can still do the stupid go from point A to point B, go back to point C, go left to point D, and that whole stupid thing. That's how it works now again. Some of us don't like that. It's, it's, it's whatever. My opinion, it's back. So, the other thing is they have its they have said that they're going to put in PvP players 
gamer trainer battles like one on one in trading now because of all of these bugs lately obviously this is not coming anytime soon so we all know that they have confirmed it and it is coming and that's really cool and that's really exciting but you know right now I'm really more concerned with like they last week also opened it up to like 15 other places and I'm like can we just fix shit first for real can we fix shit first this is not the point so you know in time in time guys I have n I have lots of faith for this I'm not worried I think this is going to go great, going to go good. Have fucking faith in Pokemon, man. Pokemon's not gonna let this fucking down. Hello? Duh, this is riding on them too. And I think people seem to forget this. Everybody's just like, oh fuck Niantic! And I'm like, well, look at Niantic. They haven't posted anything since July 27th. Their heads are down. They're trying to figure this shit out, guys. So. Don't give them such a hard time. Now, all that aside, that's all the controversy, the drama, the, the, the shit going on with the outside world of this. Let's get back to this. This ended up being quite a good spot. You see here, we're catching the last Magnemite. We ended up catching a total of four. Like I said, I want to come back around seven. So, maybe in the next video, I'll be back here at seven. Maybe not, I don't know. Either way, you guys are gonna have to stay tuned and subscribe to find out. So, do that. Hey, you! Hey, listen! Yeah, you! Look! Be sure to scroll down and hit the subscribe button. And the like button. And follow me on Instagram. And of course, Twitter. That way, we all stay like family. And we're such a good family, too. And be sure to share it with your friends and family. Come on, guys. <laughs> this is Ludo Kluklovich, signing off. And as always, may the valor watch over you. Hello, guys, and thanks for watching. Tune in next time for another episode of The Paul. You fucking get it. See you next time. I'd fuck me. I could be like model.